This is the energy vibration reading for the Libra and Sun Moon and Rising sign. Um, it is the year 2019 energy vibration reading, and I want to say Happy New Year um, to each and every person. Thank you for being here, um, for supporting me in the year um, 2018, and I want to say to each and every person. Please share these videos. Share, share, share these videos. I love you, Librans, and I'm wishing and hoping a wonderful you have started the year on a positive note. So, and I'm wishing and hoping for you, Librans, that it's going to be um, staying like that, okay? Because I love you, Librans. Okay. I hope you had a wonderful Christmas um, because. Um, you're about to start New Year's with the energy of the star and the energy vibration um, for the first quarter is all up um, so go take a look at that because the first three months shapes um, uh, the first three months basically shapes your um, year um, to show you what is going to be transpiring and happening in your year okay you begin with the star and the Sun and um, the energy of the Emperor so um, these were good energies that you have um, begin the year with very very good positive energies so um, you're going to be um, checking out the rest so um, you liberals, I want to say thank you, thank you so much, and please like, share this video. It is very, very, very important. So we're going to be calling in um, the light beams, um, the pure light beams, Archangel Michael, um, all allegiances, angels, Saint Christopher. So you guys are going to be traveling, Saint Antoinette, um, 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 some some padre the healing um healing angels so, so there's going to be a lot of healing once i call upon the angel they're the ones who wants to come in the ascendance masters lord kutumia um lady nada um la pastelitina so all of these beams um want to come in so we're calling up on also um the energies of all the positive light beams and beams who work um protecting the liberants um for the liberants uh, um, um to give the message for the liberants oh my god you liberants oh good second period is not look a second um three months is not looking that good what's happening to you liberants huh oh you have a um you have a lucky dip you have a lucky dip so that is going to be good um yeah new journey in october you have a lucky dip so that's good wheel of fortune okay i'm no longer worried for you guys okay now there is a lucky energies and um we all are going to be choosing that energies together I'm not liking the second period for you guys, but I can't change it. Um, it's it's better that everything happened in April to June um, than it happens the end of the month or um, that sort of a thing. Okay, so um, we have this word. We have the moon, the tower, and the devil. We have the moon, the tower, and the devil. Okay. Um, just you know behind each other so just behind each other all right now we have one of the luckiest card in the deck and this is coming up in the month of September I'm seeing September as one of these lucky months um, March 
and September as one of these lucky months so um, with this lucky card we are going to be choosing um, um, another energies to find out um, what is the fountain is going to bring you Libras what is the fountain going to bring you Libras what is the fountain going to bring you Libras the lovers the lovers so this is good um this is basically good okay so you have the extras of right there the energy of the lovers so this is this is just absolutely fabulous with the energy of the lovers um, what you're dealing with is that then you have the full then you have um, the wheel of fortune and you end up with the eye princess which is really not bad considering um, it's not bad considering um write this number down or all these numbers one three one three 13 transformation debt okay that is debt 13 transformation debt okay as I look at um, your year it is not because you we have the energy of the lovers here it's not going to be um, that of a body here but we have the energy of debt so it's going to be um, transformation okay um, if that's it then you know that's it 10 and 3 13 so you come out with um, transformation debt and then the tower okay so um, there's a whole lot of things that is going to be shifting in your life you have the number 13 um, in this year for your energy vibration number 13 so there is just going to be a lot of shift a shift of energies that is going to be coming in okay and you just have to deal with it because basically what is transpiring and what is happening is that the wheel of fortune is here you have the wheel of fortune as the central the crowning of your year and this is just so good having the wheel of fortune because whatever that was blocking your growth whatever that was stuntering you whatever that hold you um, fast at fast pace this is going to be ended this is going to be removing out of your life and this is going to be positive so um, write down the number 13 because you have the number 13 now remember that these readings are 50 minutes long um, and if you want to pick up the external um, deal of this reading you can always connect with us on um, um, on demand and it's just one dollar ninety nine so um, you know not to worry about it it's just one dollar ninety nine um, and you, you receive the, the full extended reading okay because um, we're going to see how far we go on YouTube with this and then we're going to be going to the on demand okay so here you go you liberals month of January you have the energy of the star now the energy of the star is so powerful it's so wonderful it's um, it starts the year off giving you hope and faith and showing you the way forward in this year so this is going to be um, just um, brilliant if you ask this is just going to be um, very positive very brilliant moving you forward um, you're going on a, a new and better journey and whenever the star comes up the star works with the energy vibration of the Aquarian so um, in January some Aquarians could be um, helping you um, to move forward and you know really um, in a positive way um, please check out the full moon reading of December because that message would have come up in the full moon reading because they would appear um, in um, the, the astrological dale um, and uh, go back and check out the um, quarter readings because that is the first three months of the year it is January until March you will receive a lot of information to tell you about January but January is a new start it's a new beginning the star having the star in the month of January this is saying to you is that your year is about to take off in a very positive um, um, way it is good to um, order a general reading because by ordering um, 
it's good to order a private reading this is a general reading because when you order a private reading each month um, because these are all general readings okay each month in the private readings are given bowl to bowl okay if you have a business connect with me because there's a business reading I can read for your business to let you see what is going to be transpiring in your business how this is going to be going out and this is just going to be powerful um, so wonderful energies is coming in the energy of the start this is powerful you're starting the year off in a new and powerful way you're having faith you're believing you're holding the faith some of you in January wishes and dreams are coming true and this is just going to be so powerful and so positive going forward yeah it's all about a lot of you are going to be very um, promotions is going to be coming up new um, promotion profession the Sun in February wonderful positive energies um, and it has all to do with um, your life is about to change it's all about your life is about to change it's as if the universe is saying I'm giving you the the moon and the star take it and run with it make something of your life you know this this is what the universe is basically saying here I'm giving you the moon and the star yeah the moon and the stars take it and make something of your life that is your 2019 motto is take what this universe is giving you in this first three months because um you know it's going to be um, moving you at such a positive and I just got the message for your um, um, for your month energy um, for your year energy so you know it is all up to you guys however you're going to be the universe is working in your favor oh my god you guys had the last year I'm just looking back the universe is working in your favor you know and this is so good um um Um, wow okay um, you know um, I give you the moon and the star you know make your life I took moon and the star um, Wow. So, you know, this is um this is really um wonderful. Um and you can make a huge success um this year. And it depends on how you're going to be dealing with the energies in the year, but you can make this year a huge success. So, be aware of this. Um really understand what is going on for you because obviously um, this is going to be shifting um, and this is going to be shifting an alliance of you moving forward um, in you know really really positive um, energy vibration so the first three months is all about um, the transition It's all about the power um, it's all about you using your energies to propel you forward okay and this is going to be good um, and this yeah this is going to be um, just really positive really good you're going to be just aligning yourself in um, positive positive energy vibration with people in the first three months so you know I'm advising you go back listen um, to um, the energy unexpected changes are coming in but um, um, very positive unexpected changes good fortune luck happiness um, on foresight of joy so um, this is going to be just um, wonderful coming in for you Librans um, because what is going to be happening is that um, these changes that are coming in is just going to be huge 
okay and um, these changes are going to bring you so much a success in your life and move you um, to a positive 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 um, a place in your life where you are going to be just so aligned in with um, wonderful vital energies and this is going to be just um, so profoundly um, working out in your favor in a lot of, 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 of situations you know good positive energies good on X vector mm -hmm. in a good um, positive way so unexpected changes good fortune luck and an unforeseen joy okay luck happiness okay so um, your year is really really looking good um, so we're going to be moving and looking at um, the um, next the second three months of the first six months of the year okay so we're gonna look at the second quarter now this is a quarter where you have the energy of water fire fire water fire fire now remember you are an air sign person now in the month of April you could be um, coming up with some real unexpected disaster in your life that things that you know need to really release and this you're going to be releasing this and then you're going to be letting it go and then you're going to be moving forward which is which is very good but it's going to be changes that needs to happen okay so some of you could be affected where you are by water missing shortages of water or water isn't not in your house or that sort of a thing um, but these changes that is coming in for you in the month of April needs to come in because there needs to be a clarification there needs to be really clearing moving out clarification clarifying moving away from things okay the energy of the tower is here um, in the month of May May doesn't look to be a good month for a lot of people okay there is something about the month of May this year there is just going to be um, disasters and that sort of a thing so not to worry um, with the energy of the tower and you know um, what is going to be transpiring is that in April whatever the situation is you're seeing the truth to a situation now and in May you know an end is coming to the situation it's as if um, you found out that people weren't um, who they say they were and um, now you're understanding that okay these it's as if some people came in your life as hidden enemies and now you're understanding that so you let it go you know you don't text you don't call you know if the person doesn't reach out to you you don't reach out to the person and this is good because I'm seeing this happen in business situation networking work situation and that sort of a thing and um, what is coming up is some jealousy there is a little bit of jealousy is jealousy from the other um, side or it could be jealousy from yourself okay so this is um, what is coming up and what you're going to be dealing with but this is going to be coming in um, to an end um, in the month of May now leaving this first six months you have the energy of the ego now this energy of the ego is could be coming from you but it could be also that you are trying to release yourself and balance out the masculine and feminine side of yourself because this is a year of masculine and feminine this is the year of the femininity so you are balancing out the ego and the lower energies and how best to work with this is that you call upon Archangel Gabriel supervisor of Torn element master fire fire salamander and um, the angels of balancing the ego and ask Archangel Gabriel to take your ego and heal it and then return it okay or take your ego and heal it 
so you're being released of the ego okay so you no longer basically working from out your ego base you think before you act you understand if I make this decision and I make this action what is going to be and it could be that for some of you people are working um, with the ego against you or towards you and uh, um, the eye princess is here like your spirit guides are here protecting you okay so you could be finding out that uh, people are sending you negative energies or you're the one that is doing it to other people okay and then they send you something to hit you real hard okay so that could be the thing and this is the weirdest thing with um, especially um, working with negative energies and that sort of a thing what people are not aware of is that um, people will you think that you can do something and get away with it all the time and then after someone there's always someone that is more powerful than you and understand what um, you have been doing to others because sometimes people um, just protect themselves people don't go in um, the extreme of hurting other people with this energy or keeping other people down and this is what people do not understand magic witchcraft whatever whatever the thing that people use was meant to protect you it wasn't meant to use against someone else to bring someone else down it was actually meant to protect you now you guys basically um, once um, everything and not all of you not all of you not all of you not all of you so um, only the people who this is affecting okay because I'm seeing the energy with the devil and the eye princess that means some high shit energy vibration is being sent um, it's like the Shermans are battling out the battle okay mm. Ooh, I love this cafe it's Colombian so be aware of this um, what is happening in June I don't like this but um, for um, to know who is it going to affect and what is going to affect but once the devil and the eye princess is the lights working against the darkness okay once the devil and the eye princess is the light working against the dark so um, let's move on in the month of July we have temperance this is the first earth energy that comes up the stem prints and I'm realizing that the team of the year basically because um, what I'm realizing is that temperance is coming up especially for you air sign people temperance is coming up learning balance learning balance bringing balance so your balance is going to be coming in the month of July that's where your balance that's where you are going to be feeling as if because you start off the year with eye power energy with the star the star is the air sign which is your own energy vibration the Sun is the energy of the Leo's which you have this go for it energy and then you have the air vent which is the energy of the Aries that you're taking on because it has to do with business especially business people um, the three first months of the year is just going to be so powerful for you business people it's good to ask for a business year reading um, um, because I do three months um, three months out so you can know what's coming in three months out so you know it's not really expensive the business reading because when you look at it basically it's three months out so you know this is going to be good so um, again um, July is the month where balance comes in and this is going to be good because you're going to be understanding that the last three months have been so erotic with the energy of the moon you finding about about your enemies um, the scorpions could be um, showing you who are your enemies and then the energy of the tower which is breaking and handling something and now you know balance comes in balance comes and there you are it is this balance that is coming in okay so this is good now as we look at the month of August the energy of the hermit and the water sign so we have hurt water and water hurt water and water but in this quarter because 
of the energy in the squirtle you have the bonus energy that is coming up in the squirtle which is um very good it's as if the universe is going to be granting you guys something very very powerful in the month of September so open up for that but as we look at August it is a water energy whatever is happening in August has to do with um, some information is going to be coming out it could be worldwide because um, the energy of the Sun um, focusing and as, as if um, the hermit is coming in and, and yet shedding more light something um, could be coming out worldwide about a transition an end to a situation it could be that um, uh, February or March or August uh, there is going to be like worldwide is affected by a disease a sickness or something like that okay yeah you know a disease is uh, a sickness or something like that in August so um, be aware of that yeah because it's as if some of you have been dealing with certain aspect but um, it's, it's as if you haven't felt well in a long time and you didn't want and now um, it's as if the angels and guides are going to say yeah we're going to put more pressure on you that you go to find out what this is all about okay and um, if they're but you know they always just really um, uh, use the the energy to show you that something is out of alignment and then you can ask them to align it okay because a lot of spiritual people don't go to the doctor because we um, we know you know not everything was told to us and we have more information so if you notice not a lot of spiritual people go to the doctors okay so what is um what is happening here is that something and um, the high princess in the general reading is in the month of February and the energy of the Sun is there working so what is basically happening is that what you're seeing that is transpiring is that with the energy of the eye princess and the Sun is that some information is coming out some secrets and information is coming out now here you're working um, with the hermit shedding a light on something that needs um, to be seen okay so um, this is um, really um, a situation where um, you're going to be realizing that okay so then we have the energy of the lovers and then with the energy of the lovers what is transpiring what is happening in the month of February is that something very very lucky unusual it could be an unusual meeting it could be an unusual connection um, but um, whoever this person is is coming in um, is someone very special extremely very special it's as if you have had lifetimes and lifetime with this person and they're returning in your life okay um, some of you could be having um, a star seed um, intervention connection in your life so um, you could be seen um, behind the veil okay so um, um, and you know they're not ETs they're just um, they're um, star seed um, they're intergalactic beams um, could be coming in and could be helping you okay because um, it's all here and you know that's just that is, it's not strange because I this deck was bought and I knew that this would be the deck that was doing because they want to let themselves to be a known so a lot of you are going to be connected whether or not you want to believe it but whenever this happened I know you're gonna be asking me for um, a reading okay so unexpected um, um, star seed beams are going to be coming in and you guys are going to be connected um, some of you are going to be um, coming in contact with a twin flame or a soulmate and this is someone who you have known in lifetimes and lifetime 
um, this is the other person he is uh, the half of who you are so he's going to be the opposite he or she is going to be the opposite of who you are um, there could be an alignment of you looking like each other that sort of a thing um, could be happening also but whoever is coming in a lucky break in love is coming up for a lot of you guys okay I gotta look at your love energies but this is showing up now as we move forward we have the energy of the full the energy of the full is powerful the energy of the full is you going on a new journey and this is so so good because there is so much um, wonderful energies that is helping you out um, and, and and this is the the air energies because you have um, the star and now you have the energy of the fool there was no more other air energies because you were working out situations um, you were um, the truth was coming out so you were seeing the truth about a situation and that sort of a thing so um, the energy of you going on a new journey in October this is good this is positive because everyone has been getting this horrible thing about October now BAM November is gonna be like your best best month okay okay you librans okay you got the moon and the star take it run with it and make something of your life in this year okay you have the star you have the Sun you have uh, the Emperor which is business and you have the wheel of fortune listen if you mess this year up it's not my problem because I'm giving you the information use the information okay so this is this is just so so powerful now bam we have in December the energy of the eye princess another water energy so um, you know you end up with um, another water energy and this water energy in December is saying to you um, and it's right beside um, this extra energy with the lovers is that some of you in December is going to be magical it's going to be um, unusual the energy in December because you're going to be aligning yourself with this um, spiritual alignment or um, these um, um, star seed beams, star seed beams that is coming in and connecting with you. Star seed beams, thank you. You guys know I was asking for the name star seed beams. It is not ET, ET is just such a not a name. There are star seed beams, they're from different um, universes, and they are going to be coming in to help you guys. Okay, so this is just so powerful, and especially in December, December is the month. When we make our wishes and that's when our wishes and dreams come true okay so expect September and December to be a wonderful month because it's as if the universal angels are going to be coming in and helping you guys and um, ladies and gentlemen the time <laughs> run out so um, for the youtubers a happy new year and I love you guys so much okay if you want to see the extended of this reading because obviously it's going to be long because I, I'm here for an half now it's going to be a powerful reading please um, connect with me um, on um, um, on on um, on the please connect with me um, on the um, <laughs> on demand and use the link below please like share these really um, go back and listen to the general readings that I speak to you guys. Okay. Namaste. Welcome you on the month. It's the energy of the on the month energies. Isn't that wonderful? Two feet, four feet. Scales or hives may our minds stay open and our wings spend a wide. Okay, so I am using the animal um, spirit deck. So that was what I was reading. I've never read it before. I've had this deck. I love it. I love it. Alrighty, so we're going to be going in and looking at what is happening for you guys. Okay, you have. Um, another earth energy um, um, in the beginning of the year um, you guys have this earth energy that is coming in in the beginning of the year you have the earth energy the deer so a lot of people are having um, this energy okay you have the dare and the wolf 
okay you guys are have the deer under you, the wolf so the first six months of this year you're dealing with the energy of the deer and uh, um, the last six months from July to August you're dealing with the wolf okay so before I go any further with um, we're going to be looking at the aspect of the deer because the deer is an earth animal okay so um, when um because this is just so powerful um with all these earth animals and these stuff i'm i'm loving the spirit guides and i'm sorry guys i have I've, I've been so 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 going through um so much things um you know building back so much things that i haven't got to read this book yet so my excuses so we're looking at the deer which is the first six months of the year um, loving intuition graceful graceful the mother okay so the deer represent the feminine aspect of the hurt element okay this energy is available to all create um, creatures you know regardless of your gender but it is especially potential in new partners during the first few days they are fully represented in nurtures and corn in their inner beauty um, radiates and the sense of grace calm and room a dear personality of the aspect of her horns in this way drawing them towards a quiet tenderness the dare cards may appear when a birth or celebration of a new life dawns um, near or when a situation calls for absolute gentleness and compassion okay representative compassionate and nurturing balancing conceal protection and nurturing kids so it's all about the nurturing in the first six months and you know you can basically see this happening nurturing in the first six months it is really really coming up now as you move forward to the next six months from July um, from July till December what you're seeing here is the energy of the wolf which is another air sign so earth sign so a lot of earth signs are coming up we had the Buffalo and a lot of earth signs are really coming up because um, what is happening is that um, the Fox but the wolf is here so um, this is good so the spirit guides are really 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 coming in because um, you can see them coming through um, and I love this because the energy of the wolf it is an air sign so the wolf we have the bear so the wolf is an air sign um, an earth sign so um, this is powerful that you guys have two earth sign the wolf and I love this the wolf um, the guardian of the family and that I see you liberals doing and the tribe activism ritual okay that's the energy of the wolf I love the wolf because of the um, Indian they so worship the wolf not really worship but the wolf plays a part of uh, the American Indians um, lifestyle rituals and that sort of a thing okay the world's mission is to uphold the well-being and um, longevity of the pack okay healthy um, wolf energies express itself through activism activism um, and mentorship okay humanities efforts or teaching religious or political study the wolf gets into trouble when it assume everything um, members of their tribe must follow suit this in includes children walking in their parents footsteps although it will surely be uncomfortable at first practicing um, tolerance helps balance out against wolf energy contemplating the following embracing of all included now okay so when you're in balance with the wolf energy reliable um, um, drama, um, fearless um, when out of balance judgmental and domineering to bring yourself into balance practice letting go letting go letting go people it's all about practicing letting go letting go 
okay alrighty that was it for um, the spirit guides um, for um, so you have the deer you have two earth um, earth spirit guides that is coming in for you guys and I gotta go I gotta go just just one minute Thank you.